going to install a drink holder on an engine guard on a 2005 Road King. We're going to use this option right here. That is an inch and a quarter bar. So we'll take all the sleeves out and just go right to the clamp. I put the parts in the box here so we don't lose them. We take these inch and a quarter to seven eight sleeves out completely. And we go over the bar right here. You want to be sure and keep it on the round part of the bar because at this point you're metal to metal. So if you were to put it in the curve, that would be egg shaped and it wouldn't tighten right and it may score the bar when you tighten it up. So we're about 80% tight there. I'm going to add the elbow, the spacer, and the jam nut. You put the jam nut on the elbow, put the spacer on there, everything fits right inside the cavity there, tighten it up, spin it in, get you another full turn there, and then we're ready to tighten it up. Now we're going to snug that up just a little bit, so when the rider gets on we'll be able to adjust it for him. Use the bolt, one of the stainless flat washers. We use the center application versus the offset. Put the other washer on. Then we put it into the end of the elbow. And we tighten it down. Then I'll have the rider get on in just a few seconds here and have him balance it up so we're, we're good to go as far as the distance and the spacing. Pretty much. Get on the bike. Pretty good right there. Yes, sir. Turn, make sure you clear your fairing, your windshield, and everything, both directions. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. I'll go ahead and start tightening everything up. Tighten up that first here. This should draw up nice and tight. You put it where the bar is actually round. Yep. Have gone down further over here. It would have been egg shaped. It would have had to use a bigger clamp, like an inch and a half clamp. Bottom line again. Line it so the drain hole is open. This is a 20 ounce liner. And put this inside and it reduces it down to 12 ounce can for 16 ounce bottles. I'm going to tighten the top. Then we're going to use a wrench and tighten the jam nut so the elbow is nice and secure. Put about 30 pounds of pressure on there. All right. Just don't put any bottle in there bigger than 30 pounds. That's it. <laughs>